Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to go over how you can save a lot of battery when parking your Tesla vehicle for an extended period of time, such as at an airport parking lot. So if you're worried about your battery draining, there's a couple of things that we're going to want to turn off. So to do this, we're going to launch the Tesla application. And from the homepage of the Tesla app, we're going to scroll down. So the first thing that we're going to turn off is sentry mode. This is when your car records things that are happening around it. This can use a bit of battery. So to turn this off, we're going to open up security and drivers. And then here at the top where it says sentry mode, you want to make sure this is toggled to the off position. And once we have this turned off, we're going to head back to the previous page. So now back on our homepage, the next thing that we want to open up is our climate option. And from our climate page, we want to find a cabin overheat protection and make sure this is turned off. So scrolling down towards the bottom and we can see cabin overheat protection right here. This is another one of those things that can drain the battery. And especially if you're parked in a warmer area, it's fine if you're going into a grocery store, for instance, and you want cabin overheat protection on so that when you get back to your vehicle, the cabin isn't so hot. This is a comfort feature thing, but it's not necessary to have this on. So we're going to turn this to the off position so that we can save that battery and we won't have the air kicking on and using up our battery while we're away from our vehicle for an extended period. And again, heading back to the previous page. So those are the two main things that are going to drain your battery while parked at an airport parking lot. And you just got to weigh the pros and cons, especially with sentry mode. It's a security feature and it's nice to have it on to see what's happening around your vehicle. But you have to take into consideration it's going to be draining that battery while you're gone. Although once the car gets down to 20% charge state, it will automatically turn off sentry mode. So that's also something to keep in mind when you're factoring that into your decision. So I hope this video is helpful going over how you can minimize the amount of battery that your Tesla vehicle will drain when you're away from it for an extended period of time, such as when you're parking at an airport parking lot. I appreciate you guys stopping by. Consider subscribing to the YouTube channel, and I'll see you back here next time.